Oysters, an iconic Pacific Northwest product. Minterbrook Oyster Company has been growing them on the Key Peninsula Bay since 1932. Kent Kingman is the current owner. I love shellfish. I love people that love to eat. I love, I love where the office is. I love coming to work. Decades of oyster harvesting leaves mountains of shells behind. When Mark Soboil sees these mounds, he doesn't see old shells. I see an opportunity. I see an opportunity to, uh, to uh, you know, process this material um, into something that people can begin to use. Pre-pandemic, this Bainbridge Island marine scientist traveled the world, helping the seafood industry meet environmental standards. When COVID hit, um, that all stopped because I couldn't travel. His COVID pivot? Selling seashells by the seashore. I love it every time I hear it. <laughs> by launching Shellscapes. I mean, the Pacific Northwest is one of the largest uh, you know, oyster growing regions in the US. I just think that it's never really been used for uh, landscape. He's partnering with Minterbrook Oyster Company and reharvesting, then crushing shells that would otherwise go to waste, then transforming local landscapes with them. You know, we're making a tiny little contribution here. We're starting to recycle this material back into the environment. Oyster shell driveways are also good for the environment. They drain far better than concrete or gravel and don't get potholes because of this unique property. It produces what we call an oyster flower. And that oyster flower is a natural binding agent. Linda Alexander had this to say to Mark when she found out what he was doing. Congratulations on being the first person we've met who actually has the right idea about why driveways should not be pavement. Now the recycled shell driveway at her South Sound waterfront home leads to a shell pathway, a shell patio, even a shell bocce court, blending the line between home and beach. It looks great. Naturally. So it's something that is iconic to the Pacific. It's not something that uh, is foreign. And that's what I love about it. It's a local product. I mean, you're utilizing a product that comes literally from your doorstep.